I think the end of us, the whole point was like, you don't know what it, what it meant. It wasn't necessarily about them breaking up. Was it about them dying? Was it like, we don't know what the right. end of us really meant. What do you see? Two paths. Tough choice. Can you help me make it? On season four, towards the end, you have this experience where you have this vision of seeing your character and Monica breaking up the end for the two of you guys. So are we gonna see that play out as season five kicks off? There's a little more clarity on what that was all about. So I think fans can be really excited to kind of check that out. Oh yeah, Lou Grimes and Kelsey Asville's characters, Casey and Monica, are facing major life changes with a baby on the way. And we can't help but think Monica's new look is sending a big message. The cramps are getting worse. That's three weeks early. Is it possible that in the Native American culture, a haircut could signify a traumatic loss, grief. Yeah, I think you're on to something there. Really? So it isn't just... I'll try to dance around... Dance the around... Spoilers. Yes, but, dance around that haircut. But yes, I think it is. it does mean more than just a, a new do. But mm -hmm. I think, um, you know, what they go through changes them in this, um, you know, really immense way that I think will inform their place in, in, in the family and, and, and what's next for the Dutton Ranch. What you're gonna do first? What do you think I'm gonna do? You're all fired. Beth, you're my new chief of staff. Back to work. Kevin is the gov now. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this brings on some possibly great opportunities and things and, and will strengthen the fight that he's going to the extent to protect his land and his family. But at the same time, I feel like there could be a lot of complications. How is that complicating things amongst the family? Um, you know, I think we're sort of always in our own little world, right? I think John becoming the governor isn't uh, isn't the first on our priority list. <laughs> and I don't think it really changes much for us, especially because um, what we go through this season, mm -hmm. you know, we have a lot on our plate emotionally and all these other ways. and. So um, I, don't, I don't think that it really changes uh, or moves the needle for us in any huge way right, right. right at first. Yeah. Yeah, we were talking about, I mean, we didn't get invited to the party. What? Yeah. We're never uh, anywhere. We're yeah. just on our own. Just, I mean, but I'm kind of yeah. loving that too. There are a lot of cooks <laughs> in that kitchen over there. You know yeah. what I mean? So sometimes you just got to step away. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Create your own family. That's right. I love you. I just pray that y'all stay together this season, and I hope, you know, you end up having two children. So we'll see how that plays that out. Means. I don't. Oh yeah, happy yeah. ending. Big happy family. Big happy family. Please. And even dog in the mix. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> it's here. We have a dog. We have a dog. Yeah, yeah. Have there's a dog. A dog. Very yeah. <laughs> but wait, what's that's not dog's name now. What's dog's name now? Uh, it's 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 dog in. Uh, what, what? It's. I don't want to say it wrong. Dad just wants to call him dog. And I think that sucks pickled ass. Well, the dog's real name is Luna. Luna, right. okay. But what's the TV name? What's the... It's, it's... Shunka. Shunka. Yeah. Shunka, there we go. I mean, come on, y'all. Oh my yeah. god. I didn't want to say it wrong. Can we cut that? Yeah. Oh my god. No, we got yeah. our dog's again. name. The drama returns to the Paramount Network Sunday. And aside from Yellowstone, Luke has plenty to look forward to. The 38-year-old is also pursuing a career in music and will be hitting the stagecoach stage next year, along with other big country artists, including his new co-star, Lainey Wilson. I got a heart like a truck. No need tickets. Are you, yeah. Can you please save her a yeah. ticket, Can please? I come back there? <laughs> Your ultimate fan girl right here. <laughs> I love it. President of the fan club oh, already, the right? Yeah. You and Lainey Wilson are performing the same day, so are y'all cooking something up? And Ryan Bingham <laughs> from our show, too. Said you must be down on your luck. I'm out of money and I'm all out of time. And I think that was really just kind of a happenstance. I don't know about that, Lou. I don't know. But no, I, I, the only way that I know Lainey is that she came and played during our COVID bubble season. Yeah. And we have these events on Saturday so that we could all actually have something to do, not just stay in the house. And she came and played one of those and we all just fell in love with her. Yeah, I know a few things a man ought to know. Are we, we going to see some duets woven into the storylines? I don't think you'll ever see Casey sing. I think that would make zero sense <laughs> if he just all of a sudden started like Sorry, say, yeah. it wouldn't make i mean okay that would be fine <laughs> girl could dream right now <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's totally yeah way to dash sorry i meant to say we'll talk to taylor about it i'm just window shopping 
Oh, so no interest in the dance. What was it like having country artist Lainey Wilson on the show this season? Oh my God, she is wonderful and Incredible. just so genuine. And she really brought that work ethic from her music yeah. to, to acting. I mean, she's great. Yeah, yeah. such a like just awesome presence to yeah. have around. Good yeah. energy, just sweetheart. She's amazing. And the ultimate Southern draw. Oh she my God. Does. Right? <laughs> You're like, oh like what did I you say, I can listen to her talk all day, <laughs> yeah. for sure. And when she gets fired up, it is something, it's next, next level. <laughs> You're tasting some new music. Yeah, yeah. I didn't see that coming in my life. I mean, I've what? always played music. I've always loved music, and I'm, I've, I've gotten an opportunity to make some um, in, in a real way, and, and I'm thrilled, man. I just, I uh, just want to make something good at the end of the day. We'll see what happens. How did that happen? It was just sort of like, you know, sending little things I was working on to friends. One thing leads to another. Somebody hears it. Someone else, you know, somebody calls me. And it just sort of happened. It was it really organically and, and in a way that feels like, I mean, I, I'd kick myself if I didn't take this opportunity. That's you know? incredible. Did anyone on the show help you kind of... Um, you know, kickstart this. I mean, there's some there's really people that have been really encouraging about it and have yeah. heard me play or whatever. But uh, I don't know. It could be someone that I don't I don't know. Honestly, I just feel lucky and blessed. And and I, how did this happen? I don't know. All of our cowboy dreams are coming true with oh. you. I mean, you know, it's just like <laughs> oh, it's kind yeah. of perfect here. So what? What I'm do you find to be serenaded? That's right. Totally. Yeah. Kels, what do you make of Luke's music? <laughs> oh, I'm just I'm really excited for him, and I think it's. It's such a, 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 I think, a natural progression. I, um, I mean, I've heard him dabble on, yeah. the, on the guitar, and mm -hmm. he's, he's really, really good. I love Montana, but I'm doing this for our family. We need to talk. I do this for my father. I don't do this for me. How much does Taylor give you guys in regards to your right. storylines? How right. far out? Do, um, do you have right. any input into your character's development? I think he loves keeping us in the dark. <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I think he gets Why some do you think? Out of, like, I, don't I don't know. I mean, I think we're, he, he likes us to Don't experience it the way the audience front, is, the experiences it. And I think he's also kind of writing it as it goes as well. I know he knows how this whole thing ends because he so, told me that, uh -huh. but I have no idea what that is. And um, I actually like it that way. It's a good yeah. way to approach everything. It feels like you're kind of living this second life. You know, life's that way. Yeah. Kind of great. This is it. Yeah, I think so too. What is something behind the scenes that would surprise fans? I don't know. I don't know. We, I mean, we honestly, we have like a really good time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not as sad as we are on the show. <laughs> That's exactly. Exactly. It gets yeah. heavy from time to time. Yeah, yeah especially, for, like, we're always sad. We're always got something yeah. really bad going on and, we're, you know, we're just... Yeah, but don't worry about us because we're having a good time. Yeah, we're having yeah. a great.